everyone today i anshna mahavar is going to share some stepping stone information on career guide for aviation industry this airline career guide is the outcome of all the queries that come to us on daily basis regarding the career in aviation industry and more importantly all the air crew training and so we decided to answer all the questions and give all the possible useful information to help you make decisions now before starting i would like to talk about why should you become a cabin crew firstly you need passion and glamour to pursue it secondly you should be able to maintain your reputation in this career last but not the least you should have a childhood desire in short born cabin crew now before you embark it is most important that you get assessment from your country's civil aviation department by reading car that is civil aviation requirement thoroughly here is some information and effects of incident on the aviation industry so aviation industry worldwide is a recurring market and the industry is affected predominantly by economics politics and some part of the globe with acute terrorism now we all know about how deadly the 911 attack was but very few knew that it had a negative impact on the airline industry while in the other regions tourism sustained and some picked up and all the local airlines and charter companies far rather well outside an airline not all the cabin crew choose an airline career there are many other specialties just rewarding other areas available are corporate aviation if you intend going in the airline route some bigger airlines prefer hiring cabin crew with experience from structured airline environments so by vast preparation and luck if you could get into the aviation industry i would like to let you know about the remuneration obviously this is a difficult subject to generalize on as salaries vary extensively around the world it is known by one and all that the pay scales in the airline industries are extremely high and lucrative this is one of the main reason which attracts a large number of youngsters and other people to take up a career as cabin crew in the airline industry the salary of cabin crew member who is majorly a beginner or a fresher may range anywhere from 10000 to 50000 indian rupees on a monthly basis in the case of small indian airlines and in the case of private bigger airlines such as defunct kingfisher air dickin jet airways spice jet sahara airlines the pay package offered is even a lot more The salary of a cabin crew member who is majorly a beginner or a fresher may range anywhere from 800 to 2000 US dollar on a monthly basis in the case of an international airline. Work experience increases the pay package offered to the cabin crew member. Cabin crew members salaries also increase depending upon their capabilities. a cabin crew within a few year of work experience can get a salary of anything between 2000 to 4000 us dollars per month although in the case of cabin crew along with experience the salary may also vary on the basis of the performance at times the salary is also paid on an hourly basis the cabin crew salary along with an attractive salary there are also a large number of perks which come along with a job in the airline industry such as free air tickets for the cabin crew member as well as his or her entire family the airlines also pay for your hotel accommodations as well as your meals when you have a layover now before you spark with some interest i would like to quote you here with one small tip that is guard your reputation well airlines do their homework meticulously 
internationally this is a close knit community and if you have a reputation as a heavy drinking casanova or a flamboyant show off you can rest assured that the selection board will know about it before you arrive for the interview better have some answers ready now i will be concluding that the cabin crew career is highly lucrative one only if you know how to make your career advances in the right way i hope my advice goes some way in helping you with make a decision about your future before you take the decision to become an air international airlines cabin crew you must read the following do's and don't for cabin crew Normally for a safe and comfortable flight you need a pilot and cabin crew this book is also written by a pilot and a cabin crew to answer most of your frequently asked questions by captain shekhar gupta and his team now i'm ending with some of the precious words always remember take off is optional but landing is compulsory Thanks a lot for listening to me and I hope you took some of my words with you